welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a PO Box opening video and this is my second one on this channel. Um, before we jump in, I just want to let you guys know that I have sent back letters to everyone who has sent me letters in my last PO Box opening video. And secondly, I'm going to be doing a Q&A in my next video, so I'm going to be posting that up sometime next week. Um, so I'm going to pick an afternoon, grab a cup of tea and just have a nice relaxed afternoon answering all your questions. So I'm not going to go through previous comments in previous videos. I'm just going to be searching in this comment box below this video. So if you guys have any comments you want to, I mean questions you want to ask me, um, please pop it in the comments box below and um, it doesn't have to be snail mail related. It can be absolutely anything. So I'll just pick um, a few questions that I want to answer and I'll sit down, grab a cup of tea and answer them. So let's jump right in and I'll start on the video. So the first one I'm gonna open here today is an international letter. It is looking like it's from the UK. Um, yes, it's from the UK and it's from Lauren. Ooh. How pretty is this envelope? I love that. What? So it says read me, I'll pop that one aside and open that one at the end. And then the first thing I see inside is, I think it's a card or it might be one of these flip books, but it is beautifully wrapped. Ooh, it's so pretty. You guys put so much effort into this, it's so amazing. Okay. Oh, it's a little flip book, I love this. All right, so. On the front it says things like Kappa and London and Soho and it's so nice. And you open it up and it's got this little pocket here with all the clouds on it and this little craft pocket that flips down. Oh my god, this is so ah. Okay, I'm gonna see what's inside. Alright, so so on the inside it says I only hope that we don't lose sight of one thing, that it all started with a mouse. Walt Disney. That's so nice. And it's got a little Mickey Mouse sticker on the front. Oh, it's actually one of those moving stickers. What's that called? Um, holographic. And if you put him down, he's like a vampire. I mean, what is he? Just angry? It says angry Mickey. We got lots of little goodies in here. Thank you. Thank you so much, Lauren. I'm looking forward to go through that in more detail and read your letter. All right, so the next one I'm going to grab is this one. So this one's from Holland and it's got some beautiful stamps on the front and it's got some Spirited Away washi tape on the back. So let's open this one up. Oh, there's so many goodies. Alright, let me put this one aside. Alright, so the first thing I see is some Turkish apple tea. Alright, so in this first little pouch it says more goodies. So I'll open up this little one. Oh, and it's like a whole bunch of like little tags. Let's see what it is. So there's like little tags and oh, that's so cute. And there's some little washi and I love this washi in the middle. It's like, it looks kind of like um, they're drawn girls. Like it looks like it's straight out of a sketchbook. <gasps> There's some more of this beautiful washi. Oh, and they've added the Spirit Away washi. Thank you. I love that. Some little tags or stickers. Her, a list of her favorite songs. So I'm keen to go look those up on the internet. Oh, and things are falling out of this. Oh my God, there's so much inside. Oh, these cute little cat memo, little pads. They're so cute. Alright, and I'll read this one later, if not this video will go on forever. So thank you so much. I'll pop that aside. Alrighty, oh, what's next? Alright, what is in this one? So it's Irene from Canada. Alrighty. It's so beautiful, this um, envelope. I don't know if she made this one herself, it actually looks handmade. Okay, this letter is so cute. I think that's a little like stamp. She must have stamped each one of those separately. Sakura flakes. Oh, never heard of Sakura flakes. 
But I'm guessing it's these two little flakes. I'm not going to open it up yet, but I'm guessing it's these little flakes that are on the front. They actually would be really nice because they look like um, tree blossoms. So they'd be really nice to put in my um, travel journal when I take it to Japan. Again, another tea. Oh, and inside it looks something Canadian. I can see the Canadian um, leaf on the front. Oh, she's hand um, stamped all these. And they do, they look very Canadian, a few of these. That's, really, that's a really cute idea, I like that. And then we've got some spring flowers. Oh, and this packaging is really beautiful. I love that. I'm going to open that in a second, so I'll pop that one aside. This one is from Australia, I'm guessing, because it's got the Australian stamp on the front. Oh, there's so many flakes, I don't want to get them all in my bed. Eee, get out, get out, get out! Okay. Eee, get out. Alrighty, what have we got in here? Ah. So this is what was inside and this little one here. So I've got this little, I think it's just a tag that sits on top. Or it might be a sticker, I'm not sure for that one. Um, this one looks like a little sticker. So she's also added just a little memo pad in. Um, and it looks like she's actually just made this collage and printed it all out. That's really cool, I like that idea. Okay, what is next? Danielle from the United States. So on the front it looks like this with a whole bunch of little stickers all over it, some washi tape, so she's decorated it really nicely. I'm just going to check if it's still recording, it is. Some washi tape on the back and it says good mail and it also says air mail. Ooh, what's in here? Oh my god, there's so much stuff in here. I wasn't expecting so much stuff in such a, a thin envelope. Alright, so... Oh, she's made a design. A zine or zine, I don't know. People pronounce it differently, but I call it a zine. People call it a zine and it annoys me, but to each his own. So, get to know me. Oh, so it's a little, little booklet about her and she's made all these collages and she's printed them out. So it looks like she's made them, photocopied and then printed them out on a little book. Oh, that's so nice. I'm gonna read through that in a second. Um, next are these little, what are these? I don't know what these are, but they're really interesting and quirky. I like them. Um, we've also got some stickers, and these are adorable. How cute are these? And some sandcastle stickers. So when I do a beachy theme, I can add that one in. Um, we've got a wonder wheel, and it is a postcard from New York. So that was really nice. I love that. I love everything so far, actually. All right, who is this from? This is from the United States. And it's from Logan. There's something written on the inside. P.S. I'm sorry about the late that I had trouble sending to you. Sorry. Oh, that's fine. I'm, I always write people late letters. Okay, so I've got... I've got these little things and it says hello. And it's got uh, washi samples on it. Some little memo pads. And then this is like the cutest little um, envelope in the world. And it says... Fragile, press flowers. <gasps> That's so lovely. I'm gonna keep that one aside. Um, and the letter. Oh, this looks like a big letter. I love big letters. Yes. These ones I've already had a peek at, but only a little peek, I swear. So, oh, I didn't even say who this was from. I just jumped right in. Um, this is from doesn't say. But okay, firstly I have to say, look how adorable this little envelope is. It's got the most cutest little cats on the bottom. That is the cutest washi tape I've ever seen. Very adorable. Okay, let's open it up. Alright, so... Oh, this is very exciting. Um, she's got her address and her name's Sparky. I don't know if that's her real name from the United Kingdom. We've got the letter in here, which I'm excited to read. Oh, I love this. You are amazing. That's what it says on the back. I wasn't just saying that. Look, it's Totoro, but it's like he's sitting in front of the moon and it's just his shadow. That is really cool. I like that a lot. Oh, I'm in love with this one as well. You inspire me. So that's my little Kiki K tag. Some beautiful papers. 
some more really cute, adorable papers. Adorable papers, like these are freaking cute. And then I think we will have a little sticker pocket. Hey! This looks like my little sticker pockets that I make. Oh, this looks so exciting. It's got so many cool stickers in here. Yay! Next is this pink one. This pink one's from Sophie and she's from Australia in the WA. And firstly, this is the cutest wrapping ever. Look at these little spots and these little blue twine. This is like adorable, adorable. Oh, look at this matcha tea Kit Kat flavored. I mean, flake much. Anyway, it's a Kit Kat flavor, but I'm so keen to try that one. This looks like a little eraser and it looks like a little um, sushi. This is super cute. I love this. It's got like a little sushi print all over it and inside a little, Oh, they're little band-aids and they're like themed. I think they're animal themed, that's super cute. This is my favorite thing ever. Oh my God. When I go to Japan, I'm gonna be getting like 10 hundred of these. No, I won't. Absolutely in love with that. Some more Japanese themed stationery. This is so cute. I'm gonna send this out, reuse that. Um, I'm guessing the letter's in here. That's the letter. And then we've got some beautiful cards, some beautiful envelopes. Oh, love. All right, what's next? So I've just cut this one open. I actually already had a look at this one um, when I was sitting in Centrelink because I'm currently unemployed. I know, long story, not going to go into it. But I actually had a look at it and um, she's given me like cute little adorable washies and some Canadian themed. Oh, I didn't even say who the name was. This is Anna from Canada. So thank you. And um, there's a little zine inside here. Or zine if you want to call it a zine. Um, these are cute little magnets. I'll actually open this one up right now and show you guys. Sorry, my partner Dan came home and my camera turned off. So I wasn't even sure where I got up to. The camera just sort of died. And um, I was up to this letter here and basically... What I was saying, this was from Anna from Canada, and I was just showing you um, a few of these handmade magnets and stickers. Um, I'll put the links in the description box below. They are handmade, and they are adorable, and I love everything handmade. And then inside this cute little pink envelope, it's the little letter. So I'll pop that one aside, and I will be making you some cute things back and writing you an adorable letter. And lastly, I did just open up, <laughs> because the camera died, I already opened it out of its packaging. But basically what I was saying was, it's adorable pink packaging, and um, it's got cacti all over the front. Now when you open it up, it also is a handmade envelope inside, and it says, Brittany, can we be pen pals? And yes, yes we can. So inside, it has a little list of all the things that she's included. So she's included some tea, some washi samples, three cool postcards, some homemade stickers, her first ever zine, um, some Roald Dahl stationery, and it says that she's obsessed with Harry Potter and that she doesn't mind what theme I make hers. So I'll be probably definitely be making Harry Potter theme, but also these are all things that I love as well. So I'll be chucking in lots of goodies for you. And it's like this cute little pocket envelope. So very adorable. Aww. So that is everything for today. All the letters that came in my um, PO box this week. So thank you guys so much for sending me letters this week. Everything is absolutely amazing. I'm over the moon with everything. And um, I will definitely be sending you all letters back before I go to Japan. And um, yeah, thank you so much. Um, oh, and remember that I'm going to be doing Q&A in my next video. So don't forget to check a few questions in the comments box below if you want to ask me anything. And I'll see you guys next week. Thanks for watching again. Bye.